celebrating National Taco Day with a top secret tour of Toyota TRD in Newport Beach, California. Now, TRD stands for Toyota Racing Development, which you've probably seen on a bunch of race cars, as well as on the side of a bunch of trucks, like the Taco, I mean, Tacoma, Forerunner, Tundra, and Sequoia. This, this particular TRD facility is home to the company's NASCAR engine building efforts. 5.7 liter all aluminum pushrod V8s that scream all the way to 9,000 RPM, and they would make 1,000 horsepower if NASCAR didn't limit them to 700 horsepower. During our tour, we saw all sorts of really cool machining, inspection, simulation technologies, and I can't show you any of it because we don't want GM and Ford to learn how to make better engines. But I can show you this Toyota... Toyota Tundra, but I, however, but I can show you this Toyota Tundra prototype truck, which is actually a hydrogen fuel cell generator that's completely portable. Now the truck itself, that's a standard Tundra, twin turbocharged V6, the business. What they did on the back was they took a Toyota Mirai hydrogen fuel cell powertrain and they've turned it into a generator. I think it's 160 kilowatts of peak generation and it can power more than an entire city block and they take it around to events to power up various tents and they sometimes they bring one sometimes they bring two trucks today it was powering our taco truck also because of some really interesting nascar regulations that means that you have to use the engines more than once sometimes three times per season that means that trd is building fewer nascar engines per racing season which gave them some extra time so they cooked up these really trick upper billet control arms for the tundra sequoia tacoma and forerunner you've probably seen them in the aftermarket catalog and they're also becoming standard equipment for models like the Trail Hunter and the TRD Pro. And what's neat about them is that they're obviously lighter, they're stronger, they're billet aluminum, and they also relocate the ball joint that gives you better geometry when you're lifting these vehicles. And what's really cool about them is that they make them here in Southern California. So they forge the aluminum, they CNC machine components of it, they wash it, they do the whole thing, they take it off to get color via anodization, and they get anodized, bronze for Trail Hunter, red for TRD Pro, then they get powder coated clear, and the goal here is that they're gonna last for many, many years. You can run them in the rust belt, you can put the wrong chemical on them and they're not gonna peel, and they should last hundreds of thousands of miles, and that's another thing that they're making here at this facility, which made it an amazing tour. Anyway, have you been driving your taco? Have you eaten tacos here on National Taco Day? Let me know in the comments down below, and for more, check out ClubLexus and Yodatech.com.